ladies and worms. Welcome to an episode starring me, myself, and I. We are going to be playing a game called Wolfenstein 3D. Remember this game? I do. This game looks like it was from 1992. That was one year before I was born, so that would have been 28 years ago. All right, this was made by ID Inc. Software, programming by John Carmack and John Romero, creator- <laughs> I'm not gonna read all those. Um, oh cool, there's like high scores on this. Uh, yeah, so um, welcome to another episode. I am going to be playing this game. There, um, I remember this game actually, um, are you ready? To, well, let, let me get rid of this. Um, do you remember back in the 90s? This is a very 90s statement. Uh, my brother actually would play this game in the computer room. That's something you haven't heard in a long time, isn't it? The computer room of my grandma's house, and we would play this game on CD-ROM. Yeah, so it was it was quite a bit ago. So we're gonna be playing it today on a 2020 gaming PC and see how it goes. Uh, yeah, so let's let's go ahead and get started with a new game. And we are going to escape from Wolfenstein, or Wolfenstein. All right. Um, how tough are you? <sighs> Some of these are just really funny. Um, can I play daddy? And don't you love that? Don't you love that little, little man, sir, there? Don't hurt me, bring him on, or I am death incarnate. No. I usually play on the second to easiest, um, just as a general rule, so that's what we're gonna play on this one. I don't remember how difficult this is. I don't think it was that difficult, but we'll find out, won't we? So let's, let's just play Don't Hurt Me. All right, let's get psyched. Are we psyched? Oh boy, okay, so we just start off um, with, you know, this scene, this lovely scene, a dead soldier in front of us inside of a blue dungeon room and our gun is coming out of our stomach, right? Like, you know that meme where they're holding it right in the middle? I guess that's what's going on here. Okay, so let's take a look around. Uh, the keys, um, this is back, I don't know, maybe this is back before or just maybe it's the way this emulator works, but the keys are actually up, down, left, and right arrow. Um, so I don't know how to play it. Um, like, I don't know the other controls, so I'm just gonna be clicking around and I apologize. I have one of those really clicky, mechanic-y keyboards, so that's gonna be annoying, but you'll deal with it, right? Um, yeah, let's take, so, first off, I mean, blue rooms, okay, I guess that was a really cool thing back then. Um, back in, I don't know, in the sixth place, the 40s in Germany, maybe, um, that was the aesthetic. All right, so let's go through this door. Okay, so space opens. Looking around, I, I just love how I love how simple it is. And by love, I mean I don't know if I actually love it, you know, and like genuinely or just like, haha, look at that. Okay, so there's food and oh how cruel. This this poor man just wants his chicken dinner, but I shall eat it. Nope, I shall not eat it. Okay, never mind. Oh, uh, that looks like it could be something. Ammo, nice. So yeah, look at it. It just the map and everything is so different than what we're used to. You know, it's so weird not playing with a you know a crosshair or even the uh, you know the gun coming from the uh, the right side. You know, so it's been uh, it's different. Is this a door coming? Okay, dead soldier. Dead soldier bones, food, and I, I remember in this game you would, like find secret doors by just like clicking the. Uh, the walls, but I don't think there was anything other than good luck in finding it, you know what I'm saying? Like, it was just, I think now in games there's maybe like a little noise or something to go with it, does that make sense? Or like a noise, or maybe like you can kind of tell that the, the pixels are different, or, you know, I was thinking about it like, are games easier now than they were? Because Here's something I've noticed um, with these types of games is you're just kind of thrown into it. I mean, I'm sure there was something in the, you know, manual or, you know, whatever in the back. Oh, hello. 
Oh, so we're definitely in- Okay, 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 okay. All right, so control is shoot. Okay, cool. So we just got shot by a Nazi and killed a Nazi. So hooray, let's shoot this Nazi just because I don't even care. We're going to waste an ammo on that. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, you were just- you're just kind of thrown into games with no real, pr not not purpose, but maybe it is on the back of the game, like, you know, the box or something. It, it'll, ha it'll have something there, but I didn't read the box because I remember this game more or less. It's just escape from the castle, right? Escape from the castle, kill Nazis, how, you know, can, can get, what could be better than this? <laughs> just guys being dudes. Um... I really hope I don't have to kill the dog. Oh, it looks like I'm gonna have to kill the dog. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Please don't watch this. I'll put, I, maybe I'll put a little warning um, for this video because that, now I'm, it's coming back to me. I think that happens quite a bit. Oh, so sad. Oh, that pot does nothing. And that's nothing. Okay. Oh, I guess I ate dog food and you know, sometimes that's, that's you gotta, you gotta have some to get you by your day today is that kind of day you know when you're when you're escaping you know a german nazi dungeon prison and you're hungry i mean maybe i would you know eat some uh <laughs> some uh, purina puppy tail you know um okay so nothing see yeah I, I really don't know what i'm doing i'm just kind of walking around Trying to find a purpose. I don't think I can shoot these. Nope, I can shoot them, but nothing's gonna happen. Alright, let's get back out. Yeah, I remember watching uh, my brother play this all the time. Anytime we would visit my grandmother, I was like, I please play Wolfenstein. I love watching him play it. I, I think that's. Oh, jeez. Ah, um... oh, see, there we go, there we go. Um, press space and I can be a secret room. Haha. <laughs> Nice. All right. Um, I'm. I don't know if that's like when my, if I can blame my brother for liking gaming and you know ruining my social life. Thanks, bro. Um, <laughs> no, <laughs> I love gaming. It's it's so much fun. Uh, I remember watching him play, and you know that that used to be my favorite thing. I, and this was back when I was, gee, maybe like seven years old. You know, I would I would. Please. Okay, that that's that's a something that happens to me. I get stuck in environments all the time. No, but yeah, I would watch him, and I would always want to want to watch him play it. Maybe I just wasn't good enough to play it myself, so I would make him play it. You know, um, or I just you know, I guess it's interesting, right? Because uh, we like watching people play games. I guess maybe some of y'all are watching me right now, and you're like, yes, like I this is what I'm here for. I don't know. But it's an interesting concept, just watching people play, and I guess you could just, you know, have it, you know, kind of like low stress, but still enjoy the game. Maybe that's sort of its appeal. Uh, but yeah, I certainly do remember watching him play for hours, and I would always like that. And of course, who doesn't love watching <laughs> people kill Nazis, right? I don't care what background you're from, that's going to be pretty... I think a pretty uh, universal uh, feeling there. So, always feel a little better playing this game. Oh gosh. Okay, so here's here's one thing. I am gonna get lost a lot. Um, so I apologize in advance. That, that was actually a lot quicker than my other games. I usually will walk around over and over and over. Not uh, really know where to go. Cool. All right, we completed uh, floor one. Awesome. Way to go, team. Kill ratio, 90%. Secret ratio, 20%. So that's like, you know, when I would open the doors or whatever. And treasure ratio, I guess those were all those goblets, you know, that I found. Goblets and crosses. All right, let's get psyched. All right. You psyched? Let's, let's do it. I'm sorry for yelling. Um, the thing to- oh, please look away. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, not cool. <sighs> At least there's- I don't know. You know, they're, they're Nazi dogs. We, um, they're, they're not real dogs. They're, um, uh, they were, they're Nazis in this messed up form and that makes it okay. 
I don't know, I have to justify it to myself or else I get too sad and we'll think about that um, forever and then we'll just have a bad time. Careful. Oh my gosh, it's so awful. I'm sorry. I fuck it. I don't know. I wonder if there's like a mode where you. Sorry, I just got very distracted by the random sink. Very interesting. Um, uh, architecture design. Oh, does it open maybe? No. Because I'm definitely not sure where to go now. Because I. Oh, is there another room over here? I see. Everything looks the same. Oh, okay. Uh, maybe I wasn't here. Um, that was pretty easy. So, okay. Maybe I should make the harder mode. Um, but I never, I never know with these games. I never know what I'm getting into. Um, obviously, when I was a child, I'm like, this is surely the most difficult game that has ever, you know, been done. But now that I am a old spinster <laughs> at the age of 20 and 7 I am a little better a little better judge of what's difficult and what's not no I wonder how difficult it was to like create all these different you know scenarios so you know there's like f there's like four things right there's like this wall there's the blue wall and just like a bunch of random like, could they have done different paintings? I, I don't know. I guess maybe that's a secret I will never find out. Look at that, one shot, one kill. Ooh, one shot. You know, I wonder if they design these people to kind of look like these plants. So you waste, waste bullet on plants instead of Nazis, which you should never do, by the way. Um, if you have the chance, you know, I would always pick, uh, bullet for Nazi versus bullet for plant. Uh, that's a personal preference, um, don't know what else I can say to that, but I hope everybody else agrees. Here's more sinks. So, like, of all the things that could have animated, or, you know, pixelated, or whatever, they, they chose sink. Whoa, okay, I'm very low on health. I did not even realize that, so I gotta be careful up in here. Now I'm good. Oh, okay. I know there was some, like, kibble somewhere else. Here's something I would wish. Uh, strafing would be pretty neat. Okay. <gasps> Food! Yay! Right. Turkey dinner to um, fix those, uh bullet wounds, right? Um, that's why mama always said, uh, finish your, finish your food, eat your vegetables, um, you'll never know when. You'll need to patch up some, um, oh, gaping wounds. All right. All these goblins. Oh yeah, the Nazis did love treasure, didn't they? I mean, we all saw the movie, uh, what was that movie with, uh, Harrison Ford? You know the one, Indiana Jones, yep. You know, the Nazis sure love their weird artifacts. Got them. Didn't win the war, so happy about that. And now I'm, I'm lost. Now I'm just gonna keep opening doors until I see moving Nazis, and that's gonna. It's gonna be the theme of this floor. Carnage. I think that door is to this. And I doubt they would make it, like, a difficult to find door. You know what I'm saying? Like, if. Like, it, it's not like a secret door. Like, there's gonna be a door. I know what I mean. You're watching this, so... I don't know. Figure it out. Oh. Okay. Yeah, but I, I just wonder, like... is Would it have been difficult to make, like, different Nazis? You know, the ones that are, like, in the... In the... Uh, beige and blue like maybe here and there like a different a different flavor if you will um with a uh, uh, maybe like a black suit or something i don't know maybe for historical accuracy <laughs> i don't know what i'm rambling about <laughs> 
pistol sure has a lot of ammo. Oh, I'm an idiot. You can carry clips. I'm sorry. Please don't think I'm this stupid. All these doors. And something I do like about, like, modern games is that there is a map. Again, I will never really get over how I have no idea where I'm going. I bet you that elevator door is going to be here somewhere. It's going to be like right here. Yep, sure is. So... Is that the other way I went? Definitely was not anything. Right? I finished that? Oh, because I went this way. Did I go the other way? Oh, now I'm lost. Perfect. Okay, this does not look familiar. Oh, and I heard a... Yeah. So one of the- there's definitely like a secret here and there. But- oh yeah, cause like, I was like, if you can animate those random sinks, why wouldn't you animate- And by animate, again, I mean just like, random- uh, Period pieces that make or I don't know, make a little more sense, I guess? I'm gonna shot up here, right? Oh yeah, look. Bam, look at that. Look at that snipe. Cool. Girl, I don't even know if I, I if I um finished my statement from earlier, but uh, mini maps, I think that was the point I was trying to go at. Um, mini maps would be great because I keep getting lost and you're gonna see that. And again, I am sorry for the inconvenience and I hope you can forgive me for my transgression. Ah. Oh, getting on environments again. Alright, nothing here. I'm just button mashing these portraits. Um, doubt it. Okay, I think so. Alright. Oh yeah, I guess I'm low on health. So we have these uh, turkey dinners, you know, just sitting around, you know, buy some fats of acid. Um, oh, here we go, here we go. That looks like an officer, like lieutenant, or like Ubermensch or something, or whatever. <gasps> More Leben! That means my life, I think. I'm pretty sure that's what that means. Oh. Awful, there's, there's that sink again. I think one of the sinks had like some like a puddle next to it, didn't it? <laughs> How funny! A little a little humor from the uh, from the artists. See, I've played FPS long enough, I think, that I could just one shot them without a crosshair. Uh, gaming skills, am I right? Sure, it's a big castle. I've missed like every one of those shots. I should have been so cocky. I'm sorry. Oh, right. I wonder if I, what I can get for having a high score. Oh, I guess just a high scoreboard. Oh, good grief. I guess people cared about that. I guess I still do care about that. It just depends on the game. You know, like, I don't really care about getting high score in like Sims or something, but I'm like, oh. <laughs> uh, give me a high score and, um,. I don't know, Overwatch or something, because love that game. Love, laugh, love it. Oh shoot. So if that was if that was that door. Then Oh honestly, I wish I could remember which way I was going. Oh, he has a like a like a fucking like Uzi or something. I'm sorry for using a bad word. Oh, you would think the treasure would like heal you or something. 
Or maybe this- do you think this room might have like a secret just because like you had like a more difficult setup? Right when I need one. Um, okay. So I was there for sure. But now that I said for sure, I'm not sure. It's like if anyone questions me on anything, it could be literally anything and I could I could know the answer, but if you question me, I'm suddenly not gonna know. Like if you ask me, hey Omi, like how old are you? And I say, oh, I'm 27. They're like, are you? Then I'm like, well, am I? That's anxiety, babe. That's what that is, all right. Okay, now, I, now I'm lost, here we go. This, this is a section that if you just wanna like fast forward and just be like, ma'am, just get to wherever you need to go, this, this will be it. There's the fat. So I think I mean I definitely check all, all those. Yeah, like part of me is like, I don't know if games will harder because there's less like direction. You know, you just gotta figure it out and just play it for fucking ever until you get the one door you haven't gone through. Um, I feel like I'm like, oh, here we go, here we go, all right. Oh, thank goodness. I really would like some health, so if any of these were secrets, that would be fantastic. No, of course not. Okay, oh, well, all right. Yep, there I am, I'm dead, game over, game over, and now, Here's the fun part. I had like 99 ammo, right? And now I have eight and I don't know where I am. So, <laughs> oh, are you floundering me? <laughs> okay, well, that's gonna be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. I will be back and play some more. Thanks for watching, folks, and goodbye. Hey, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, we'd love to hear from you. Leave a comment, give us a like, and subscribe for more. See you in the next episode. Stay, Stay wicked! wicked.